Welcome everyone to the first battle report of Underworld in a new style. Um, nothing much has changed, I just uh, split all the games from one night in separate reports and uh, did a bit of a flashy editing intro. But today I am taking Zarbax Gits, a uh, band I love and actively played back in 2020 pre-corona. Um, even went with them to a tournament which was not too big of a success, uh, ending 10 out of 12, but uh, yeah. Now that I have the new Rivals box uh, of the Mirrored City, I could fill them again and the victims <coughs> would be the Trisfold Discord, playing a Nemesis deck with Toxic Terrors mixed into it. So, of course, he was finished first by setting up and so the game began. Bonecracker happily hopped up to Vashti's, biting her in the buttocks for 2 damage, but as Garbalock tried to do the same, uh, I used a push card, and failed, Laskivir appeared out of the shadows and took the little squeak down. Not happy at all for seeing his charge being taken down, Drizgit charged up and he took out the Slaneshi Sorceress. It became a real melee on that flank and the huge lumbering Vexmore wobbled in, but he failed to hit the ferocious squeak. Talking ferocious squeaks, as you can hear on the background, Torin is also being in his squeak mode. The Git Shooter squad had lined up in the meantime and poured a volley after volley into the assassin, only managing to wound him twice though and leaving him barely standing as Vexmore again failed to take both. Down Gorbaluk, just pushing him back. The first round ended on a 4-4 for both of the forces. With the use of a gruesome visage, Drizgit was bought another round in which he could hopefully do some damage on Vexmore, as he was now equipped with Grievous 1 upgrade as well. Unable to attack the herder, Vexmore struck down the other squeak instead, and one must say, at last, before being hit and pushed back by brave Drizgit. Quite an amazing feat how the diminutive little git manages to push the hulking brute away though. But enough of the little guy shenanigans, Vexmore decides to pound brave little Drizgit knee deep into the ground. The Git's firing squad finally succeeds in shooting down the Slanishi assassin though, as another hail of arrows fell onto him, her, you know, whatever. Leaving a lightly wounded Vexmore on the table, the Gits now prepare for the third round with an 11-11 score on the tables. Unfortunately, my objective draw for that final round was a disaster, getting the cards to take someone out with a squeak, with my fanatic that I had been held back to protect my own territory, and for taking out the biggest on the board, aka Vexmore. This meant I had to try desperate measures, and while the Jealous X did lower Vexmore's wound stat, making it so I would only need to do 3 more wounds, my archers went after him. The fanatic also used his sneaky upgrade to get to the other side, but Vexmore ran off. Dodging Eldritch Bolts and Arrows, he escaped and with the Gits unable to score for themselves, Vexmore grabbed points and secured an 11-16 victory for the Trisfold Discord. But still, even though it was a defeat, the Gits Rivals deck plays uh, pretty fun. And to be honest, um, had I not uh, drawn three very bad cards and I couldn't cycle because I needed to take him down, uh, I might have had a bit of a better result, so I am quite happy with how they performed. Thanks for watching and see you again next time. Bye bye.